The only story that has dominated national headlines, and rightly so, is the Hooch tragedy. The Hooch tragedy that has led to about 62 people losing their lives, multiple people still very, very sick, admitted to different hospitals, and no accountability. There is, you know, remember, a committee that has been formed, but a good amount of politics that still continues on who is accountable, will heads roll or not. Now, we do know that in the Assembly, you've seen almost a freca-like situation again and again with the DMK Congress combined saying, we are doing enough, do not play politics. But the ADMK continuing to maintain that you need to launch a CBI probe. Nothing less than a CBI probe is what they want. We've seen the BJP also raising much the same. Now, the ADMK also has sat on a one-day strike and a dharna against this, saying that unless a CBI probe happens, we will not let this issue die down. Continue uh, when the assembly started. Continuously, we are uh, we are seeking permission to raise the Kalakurichi illicit uh, rock issue. So, so far, more than 62. It's day, day, day by day, it is increasing. The debt. It's a, it's a it's a big tragedy, and and the methanol has been travelled not only from uh, Kalakurichi. Uh, there are sources are telling even honourable uh, CM also uh, accepted in the assembly the methanol from Chennai or methanol from Pondicherry. Two state has been involved. So definitely we believe CB inquiry is the right uh, investigation agency. But let's also rewind to what happened 24 hours ago. And like I said initially, that in the assembly, you've seen a lot of drama. Because that is where people's voices, people's concerns are raised. So the ADMK continuously saying that in the assembly, we are not allowed space. We are not allowed the time to discuss this. They also say that why is an emergency motion not being moved on the entire issue? Why is MK Stalin not stopping everything else and having a full threadbare discussion on the Hooch tragedy and who's responsible? Clearly, these are valid questions, but the DMK again and again maintains that this is pure, simple politics. Do remember, most of the ADMK MLAs stand suspended for raising questions in the assembly and also for calling a CBI probe. As far as this uh, tragedy is concerned, it's a government-made uh, government tragedy. Uh, it is because of the inefficiency of the present DMK government, headed by the Mukha Stalin, that such an incident had happened. This is not the first incident, this is the second incident. So when there is a total failure of the system, as such, such an incident had happened, and this is the second incident. First incident, around uh, 28 people had lost their lives. This is the second incident, around 63 people had lost their lives. No, we had raised this issue in uh, state legislative assembly as such, and uh, democracy was strangulated there. We were thrown out, MLAs were thrown out of the assembly as such. We have also approached the High Court in this regard, uh, asking a CBA inquiry in this regard. Now, uh, Speaker has suspended all the MLAs as such. All right, so so many lives lost. Again, no one accountable, a lot of politics. But we are at Times now. We'll continue to raise that question and bring to you more details of that story. Time for us now to head into a quick break.